now we're gonna clean EGR cooler pipe and then the throttle body and then the EGR bulb so we're gonna clean we have here our lovely thing that's in there so clean very easy way gonna put everything in there and then easier ball to body so we're gonna clean it one by one we're gonna clean it one after the other okay and then clean once we put it outside like in here okay first thing first we're gonna clean this one first okay so we need a easier cleaner Shiny is that now? It's shiny. Okay. We need these things like shiny parts. This is what what we want. It's super clean. Okay. So the, the if you have uh, EGR problem guys on your engine this will affect the uh, performance no like uh, EGR plug then the engine having trouble with the uh, like uh, loss power or uh, limp mood So, to avoid that link mode, lose power, we have to clean the EGR regularly, like uh, once a year. Once a year, maybe, it depends. And if you don't know on how to do it, on how to remove parts or how to clean the parts, then you're gonna kind of message me whatever okay so we're gonna clean this EGR here as we could this is the bulb here put more so just it will suck around there So make sure you have, you have the EGR cleaner actually because uh, these uh, carbon deposits is kind of it will not uh, clean quickly if you just uh, like uh, so you need this one like uh, super clean uh, super shiny white okay so in order to do that I have to do this okay so that's good now that's super shiny I did this Unlike the, the, the unlike before, so. Let's 
this one. Obviously. Next is the turtle body. So, do not uh, do not try to move this uh, butterfly because this is uh, calibrated inside here. So just clean whatever you can there, but do not touch or do not attempt to move this uh, butterfly for the total body because uh, that's electronic control actually and that is calibrated with the inside so just try to clean as much as you can in there but do not move the the butterfly it will just stay as it is Okay. So it's very very hard really. It's getting hard. Because this one here is a lot of gunks. See? Even a uh, flathead screwdriver seems like it's very hard to push because of the carbon buildup. This will affect the performance on your engine, like uh, low power, and it has uh, more fuel consumption. When you have the throttle body uh, dirty, it also emphasizes that the when you know, the throttle body is dirty, uh, the needle or the RPM needle will go sometimes up and down, up and down the RPM up and down because the throttle body is kind of dirty no? so we need to do this in order to have yeah, like a smooth operation in uh, yeah. running the engine so, you know? These things are very sensitive because this is like kind of, of under the electronic sensor in it. So, as I said, uh, do not move the butterfly when you are cleaning the throttle body because that is a kind of calibrated thing. You just clean on that same position in there. Okay, so clean. shiny in there now we need a shiny thing that's it it's more likely clean unlike before okay is what you do if the needle gauge on the dashboard or the needle gauge on your uh, RPM is 
going up and down, up and down. And then it has uh, more fuel consumption. This is it. EGR slug or a dirty. So we need to do this. Like a uh, yearly, like. Mm. Kind of, it's not it's not really quick and easy to clean because the the carbon is already at the, it has the deep penetration on the surface so it need to take time take time to clean okay So again, I do not try it or attempt to move or to move the butterfly because that is calibrated on the inside. Just uh, clean the exposed part in it, but do not add in to wiggle or move or whatever. So, if the total body is not bad, so it will just, uh, the problem will be solved by cleaning it. But when the total body is bad, then you're gonna have to replace the total body. Because this one here, had the gears, tiny gears inside. Like a planetary gears inside here. And once it's kind of, there are, these are plastic gears on the inside. And sometimes the plastic gears on the inside will get worn and when it gets worn out and it doesn't like uh, move does it engage like perfectly so this is called the uh, lifespan but uh, obviously only for some time okay now it's clean now it's clean a little bit EGR cleaning guys is not a part of service no it's some kind of special uh, job order so it is not a part of uh, servicing okay just to let you know okay. that's a different story when you have a uh, uh, EGR uh, cleaning scenario totally different okay let's clean now Good. Busy, busy. Yeah, busy, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's going on with the <laughs> Yeah. Busy. So it's just clean. Okay, 
Jar. Let's put the body asleep. So we gotta put here. And we start cleaning just EJR pipe. EJR cooler pipe. And clean this. like a carbon deposit in here lot of carbon deposits clean. as you can see here yeah it's done, it's done No, 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 I'm okay. Uh, it's good, it's good. Grabby. Puno talaga. Puno na? Barahan yung pipe. Ah, okay. Barado. Mm -mm. Kaya parang tao ba, ayaw na siya makahinga. Mm. Okay. Ano ibig sabihin nung ano, yung pag kunwari, pag minsan ka, hindi naman lagi-lagi, minsan, in, pag in-stop ko na yung engine, mm. ano yung may, ano, sabi niya, kahit naka-stop na yung engine. No, uh, that's normal. Normal yun? Yeah, that's ah. the electronic, ah, uh, okay. uh, late action of the electronics. Ah, okay. Okay? Mm -mm. Kala ko, o kaya yung tako ko. No, 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 no. <laughs> Kailangan mo ng brush? No, no, no. This is okay. Okay ka lang dyan. Ayan. Ay. <laughs> okay. Mano na siya, no? Obviously, uh, EGR. Yan yung EGR niya? No, this is EGR pipe ah, yeah, okay. uh, this is EGR bulb this oh. is throttle body and oh. this is the EGR cooler oh, okay. pipe so okay. these are the things that uh, need to be clean uh -uh. because uh, yeah so. oh, oh god okay <laughs> <laughs>
lovely and clean. Over here. We can attach over here. And it's going around this pipe here. As we move along. Cleaning agent, EGR cleaner. So that's guys, that's how you clean your EGR pipe, EGR cooler pipe. It's like a spot is Okay, that's fast nice and clean I'm gonna pop up here Get and this is the broken body. Have a clean guys, thank you.